Okay. Okay. Got voice. Uh, got voice. It is still registering as unstable. Okay. Okay. And why is my car not saying? That's not. Maybe I need to have it. Um, nope, that's thing is this is good. This is there we go. There we go. Okay, that's one problem fixed. That's one problem fixed. Um How about all the other stuff? How about all the other stuff? That is the wrong thing. Aha! There we go. There we go. <laughs> Okay, hello everyone. How are we doing today? Okay. Okay, I think that just needed a little bit of time to uh, get back and get used to working. So, Crusader Kings 3, obviously people should be very, very, very well aware that we had a new DLC released yesterday. And here it is, Legends of the Dead. Whereas if your deeds spread far and wide, write yourself into the annals of history and build monuments to your gl own glory. Weave the rich tapestry of your legend, craft the tales that will be sung about you for a lifetime to come. So I have, um, sorry, I kind of rushed dinner because I was doing stuff way too late. Didn't even get to sit down and actually eat until, well, six o'clock. I kind of just rushed through that, so excuse me if I'm a little bit um, croaky at the moment. So we want 867, our start date, because I did try and fail. The game is actually pretty quiet. I had it down low earlier. I was uh, doing some... There we go, that's better for me. Hopefully that's better for you. You like the new table thing? Yes, indeed. <laughs> indeed, it is nice. Not quite sure how you can change from one to the other, but yes, it is very, very nice. Actually kind of gives us a bit of a um indication of where we are and how things are. So we want to be going the way down here, not to this wall but to this ruler. So I've done a few runs with this character and he always starts with the same traits. Diligent, just and cynical. Cynical is very interesting seeing as this character has a secret religion. So is he cynical for his secret religion or is he cynical for his outward religion? But either way, game rules we do actually have things so minor diseases we had that before so we can put that fewer default are our only options at black death circumstance we have uh historical which is the default settings black death will begin in central asia in the 14th century and spread organically through historically popular trade routes milan the pyrenees poland and other historical regions will be less affected by it organic which is what i've said it to but I've yet to actually have it spawn in the game yet. Or random. Or originated a completely random province on the map. So I'll put that on organic. Black Death Frequency. We can have it as once. Unlimited or never. And I think I'm going to leave that on once. Plague Frequency. Not often. Very often. Doomsday. Rare or very rare. We'll keep that at normal. I uh, wonder if there's a Sasanian ancestry kind of legend. Not one I've seen from starting up the game. Uh, when we get into it in a moment, I'll show you. There doesn't seem to be a pre-made legend seed, at least not in 867. There may be in 1066, but I haven't looked at that uh, yet. Legends by chance. We've got not high, very high, low, very low. Uh, you've seen there's some new hidden cultures you can get via legends yes i've seen that 
I did try and look to see if there was a list of uh, like the pre-made historical legend seeds, but I haven't been able to find it. So evidently, it um, hasn't been data mined quite yet. So you can get Hellenic, Troy, and Ancient Egyptian are the ones that you saw. Oh, okay. I know someone who's potentially going to be going for the Hellenic one. Because um, many a true nerd did make a mention that he was going to uh, have Crusader Kings 3 and potentially do a video on this one. So he may go for Hellenic, which would be fun. Yes, we'll have to see that. Legend costs. I'm going to keep that as normal. Um, I'm not going to turn on Iron Man just because I don't want to risk the stability. I actually had the game crash when I was trying it out yesterday. It just completely crashed. And of course, in absolute hilarity, the uh, crash reporter also crashed. <laughs> it's like I got a message just saying, it's like, sorry, we couldn't upload, upload the uh, crash file data. It's like, hey. So Iranian Mezzo, we've seen this a couple of times before, but basically if you know uh, what the Struggle for Iberia DLC was, that's similar to here, but obviously in Iran. And I did also notice that we now have birds! We've actually now got birds that fly around the map, which is good when you see these ones, uh, not so bad when you start seeing loads and loads of crows around. So there have been a couple of UI changes as well. The options for your house, religion and culture are here, as well as a new legends. So you have no legend seeds. There are no other legends in the rest of the world. No other dynasty has completed any legends. So we can keep an eye on things here. And of course we can employ a court chronic bar. So yeah, unfortunately, Start a legend from the legend seed below. We don't have one here. We do not have one here. Which is a shame because it would have been a good opportunity to have a couple of those. But oh well. I'm sure there's going to be mods around creating new ones as well. And if you reclaim the old capital of the Sassanian Persian Empire, there's a special building. Ruins of the old capital. Oh, I'll have to keep an eye for that one. We'll have to keep up for that one. Um, she know I go through chivalry. I'll go for strategy focus. Let me find the forums real quick. Sure, sure. I can see how far away it is from where I am and see if it's at all, at all doable. Okay, so unfortunately. My usual strategy of finding a woman with good genetic traits and marrying her and also uh, delegitimizing any children that I don't want won't overly work for me in this because it just tanks your legitimacy score. Uh, it's not far. You tried playing as this guy too. Was your short term goal to reclaim the old capital? Okay, fair enough. Okay, I do see one person back up here, however. Uh, 31 years old. The genius straight. I will just put a pin in you. Now. Relevance, alliance power. Yeah, none of these people are anywhere near getting a good alliance. So, unfortunately, I'm going to actually have to marry for uh, political gain and not just good genetic traits. Uh, yes, yes, I do know that men can get male pattern baldness. I did notice that um, a couple of people were calling this the were jokingly, jokingly, calling this the worst game ever because of that now. So that was you there, and you have 1,600 troops. That's not bad. And you're not too far away from that, so we could uh, bring you in if we needed to. Now for ourselves, yeah, our wife doesn't have any genetic traits to speak of. So let me just see if we get a different pool of people here.
particularly and i did think this was going to happen for some reason we don't actually get to see this person when we're trying to arrange a marriage she is with a different person why will you not accept oh right that would explain it that would explain it <laughs> uh yeah her face does not allow pol polygamous marriages damn it uh, it's in Baghdad, the old capital ruins. Okay. So that is... Okay, that's... That's pretty much right next door to the person that we just uh, got an alliance with. You can have three special buildings in a single county. The old capital ruins, the house of wisdom, and you could build a university. Ooh. <laughs> okay, that is tempting. That is tempting. No, there's an alliance. And that is just going to be us and them. It. So. That would explain why I was able to have the genius person marrying my brother myself but the question is i tank my legitimacy you want to try this guy again because baghdad seems so strong well why not you might get a legend seed for it is i'd be willing to take that um legitimacy hit if we could what am i saying of course we can of course we can. Boom. There we go. Done. Hello? Would you like to get married? Yes. <laughs> but yeah, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Effects on you. Loses 200 digitally. And leg increases legitimate level to recognize. So thankfully, as a count... We only need our legitimacy level to be one out of five. So this is going to knock us down a bit, but it's not going to knock us down too much. However, my usual strategy of doing all this and it's not going to work because we our legitimacy is just going to be in the toilet if we try this for too long. It's going to... I mean, we are, our legitimacy is going to be in the toilet. There's another special building, uh, Sanmian Fort. Again, that could be fun. It's a grand tournament, and that's just a jewel and then ceremony. Okay. We won't worry about that one. Yeah, legitimacy lost. Our father just died, which is amazing. Yeah, if we hover over here. So we are still above our average expected legitimacy, which is nice. Oh, okay, our father was our tax collector. Right, so that's not going to be too good, especially seeing as both of you have poor aptitudes. Okay, oh well. Might as well put yeah. it there. say, is that our old wife? No, it's just me. Seeing. Think I have any. Um, technically, yes, but we swap our spy master brother who's got four. Okay, yeah, I will. Do. And then. Nine is better than four. It's definitely better than zero. We'll put you there. Don't have any better money. I was going to say we're definitely not going to have any better chances. Better by one. I think we can need. Fabricate claim. We don't have anyone better. Jeez. There's a load of people with really poor stats here today. Stats. So obviously we want to settle in 
Let's make sure we build up our... I was going to say dynasty. We don't really have much of a dynasty. Build up our realm, our lands. Make sure that's all okay. And probably the first building that I'm actually going to add in here when we get the money is hospice. It's only going to give us plus five plague resistance but considering we have zero at the moment. It's going to be an interesting thing. Oh, yes, yes. Limited Crown Authority passed that law. Yes. I don't want to forget that. I definitely do not want to forget that. Doing okay. Well, you you want some onagers? Onagers dead. Station. Station you. So I think ten might be okay for at least the time. Uh, house was what I wanted. So. Okay, that's our current cultural fascination and current exposure. Sounds good, but that's 26 years and a bunch of all this other stuff is 409, 411 years. Yeah, getting that in 26 years sounds good, but I may do. Let's have a look. get the ledger so that will be 55 years that will be 44 years the only thing you don't like about this guy is the form of Zoroastrianism he secretly practices is of the incesty variety oh I love that <laughs> I know I know it's such a meme especially coming from the uh you say the king's two days where Zoroastrianism was the incest was the incest religion but I mean there's nothing saying we can't uh come out and declare our secret religion our open religion and then do some changes about it plus there's also going to be as we saw like the local faith here is Afridunism which if I try and click on it there we go so we could always go for this one. There's like concubines, divorce disallowed, unfortunately. No such thing as illegitimate. Uh, cousin marriages is allowed. Obviously not anything closer. Uh, everything is shunned and close kin staying is... A funeral tradition, sky, a very... And it's got a dismantled priesthood. Cannot recreate the head of faith under circumstances keep on I keep on getting annoyed because I expect the secret religion to be like it was in Crusader Kings 2 where you can hover over it on the religion section of a character rather than coming into the secrets even if it's your own secret that you practice that you have a secret religion you still need to come into the secret to be able to show it. But anyway, so... Yeah, mostly the same. Obviously the main difference is consanguinality, unrestricted marriages, uh, clerical gender, I think it was equal, and yet yeah, dismantled brotherhood. A uh, dismantled priesthood, not brotherhood. So... We've got... And the Zvedo da Tenant. Yes, that one is the incesty one, but let me have a one. So, members of the clergy can serve as commanders or Aswaran. Ritual hospitality can host other characters as guests, spending piety in exchange for increased appearance. Makes generous a virtue and palace a piety per powerful vessel and, and syncretic folk tradition. There's the unfull faiths to be hostile instead of it. Because it does Akun unreform faiths to be hostile instead of it. instead of evil, <laughs> not equal. Uh plus thirty opinion bonus with unreform faiths. Faith speed of converting syncretized faiths reduced by seventy-five percent. 
humble of virtue and arrogant as sin. Yes, we have the um, adherents who are married to a close family member have plus 10 opinion from vessels of the same faith. The monogamous from this marriage bonus also starts a lot. I mean, family. But honestly, I didn't specifically choose this character because of the incesty stuff. It was honestly, it's an interesting start. Genuinely. And it's just going to be one where we can potentially rebuild our dynasty and potentially rebuild at least some form of Zoroastrianism. How much is this going to cost us? 81 gold. It's fine. That. Okay, no, we can't <laughs> increase the size of either of these. Okay. Fair enough. Let me have a look here. So you have... Oh, basically nothing. You have basically nothing. Well, okay. All mine. Oh. There's no way you're going to be able to stand up to me on this. Uh-oh. We've got our first plague. Oh, at least our first nearby play. <laughs> okay, when they say nearby, they mean nearby. So, spotted fever. This is typhus. Outbreak began 13th of November 867. Okay. So, if we zoom out the way... You can see where some of the other plagues and whatnot are. So we've got camp fever there. We have plains fever. Giselle Burt Boyles. That's a name. Is most definitely a name. This goes pox. Karkand Uz Boyles. Yeah, we've got quite a few things here. I was not expecting this to be right next door. We need a court position. Your aptitude is average. Plague resistance plus 10. I don't care that your aptitude is only average. I don't have to pay you. I don't have to pay you. You're just there. Uh. So in the test playthroughs I did, a uh, couple of obviously had a couple of plagues creep in, but they all really burnt out before we got too impacted. This one is right on our... I'm sure we're going to be able to defend against this one too well. And unfortunately all the money that I was saving up for getting that hospice has now gone on this war. Which, you know, good for increasing our territory and our whole... Bad for, you know, kind of keeping ourselves alive. Yeah. We're going to be next. Okay, I don't care about you. You're not actually related to me, so I'm not going to care. Let's go to diplomacy. Probably want a cool shoot. Don't win. And your aptitude is good. That's useful. So, our physician that is now also our court shooter. And while I'm here, Master of the Hunt, is there anyone who's not got a mission? You're just one of our knights, so you can go there, absolutely. We don't have anyone for the uh, wet nurse call, so we'll just wait here. And hopefully, I uh, know that army's just walked right through that plague. Just walked right through the plague. Although, although saying about that, we're actually getting a couple of spots here that are no longer greying. <laughs> Hello, Probicus, PT Plank Crusader Kings. No way. <laughs> yes, way. How are you doing? Hope things are going well with you. Glad to see you back. Glad to be back. Crusader Kings is definitely one of my comfort games. So it's nice to be back streaming it. 
We also have some nice new content to work through as well. Because obviously we did try and do um Legacy of Persia back in December, but I did one episode before things kind of fell apart. <laughs> I did one episode before things fell apart. And yeah, the um, DLC is kind of the kick that I needed to really just get back. In. So I have put this on a schedule. We are going to be getting this on Thursdays and Thursdays going forwards. We'll have to see how well we do. Oof. Tough times for you. Broke up because you were cheated on. Family members died. Changed work, but such is life. Yeah, sometimes... Sometimes you just get things absolutely piling on top of you, but... Hope you're able to have, obviously, moments to yourself, be able to manage all of that. We persevere, yes, but there's no shame in needing to take some time to yourself, time to reorient things are going. But regardless of that, I'm glad to see you here and I'm glad that you are persevering. Okay, so this is someone who's mistaken us for a commander rather than the leader. So, learning outcome. Oh, I read that incorrectly. I thought that was 20% chance of the good outcome. No, that's 20% chance of the bad outcome. Now, this with a friendly match, or this action is considered her. is you'll lose 30 opinion of us you're no one honestly you are no one so i'm not going to care about that so i do know that we can blame the title if we get 1500 prestige but getting that amount is going to be interesting let me see, how well are you two doing? About as well as you have been doing in all of my test games, which is to say really, really poorly. Anyway, so unfortunately we have holdings here and it is in a duchy, but unfortunately the duchy is owned by our liege. So we either go to war and try and get independence which we could theoretically do because with our allies we've got more than enough troops. I don't want to quite risk that just yet. And so is your grandma passing away? 89 years old. Good lifespan, but yeah, dementia. I can, when it comes to aging relatives, I can cope with most things, but Dementia is not one of those. Dementia is definitely not one of those. Still very hard to accept, yeah. With things like dementia, I've often heard that people say there were two deaths. With that, you have obviously the death of the person when they being able to remember who people, especially who you are, and then the death of the body where the person actually physically dies and then found out about being cheated on a week later hit you like the titanic Oof. really do not understand that mindset honestly i really do not understand the mindset of cheating if you're not happy talk about it Maybe get some resolutions in, maybe break up, but either way, it's just, I really do not get cheating. <laughs> okay, maybe join the hunt. That one.
Okay, so this is, yeah, this is just a random person that I have as my wall. Don't worry about it. Ex military, able to cut. Still, it can be a lot of pressure. There'll be a lot of pressure on. Oh. I say everyone involved, it can be a lot of pressure on you. But we do have obviously the mental health and whatnot section in the Discord if you need to vent for or if you are obviously perfectly fine with how things are going, there's still people to chat to. Just things to take your mind off it. <laughs> we Gucci now. You threw her things on top of the car and had to your house. It was very cathartic. I can imagine. Yes. <laughs> that um, stereotyp stereotypical Hollywood scene of just chucking all of the things out. <laughs> threw a bucket of water on them as well. Oof. Oof. Wow. Okay, so we actually get um, some game fighting. So a deer. Which actually, thinking about it, we've got a decent amount of money. Is your attitude? 2.1 to 3. Bad. So if we wait a few, we're going to stay here for a while. Yeah, for two years. Well, three years, technically, from the start of it. <laughs> you got minus 100 stress from that. I say it'd be more like minus 300. I say more like minus 300 at that rate. Okay, so we've got wayward soldiers. So I've got enough coin to pay for the damages, which is true. Or drink, electricity. Tired of dealing with disciplined soldiers. Only need six dress because we are diligent. We do have enough boy. Okay, self-proclaimed divine guardian elf. Let's have a look. Are you good? Wow, is this me? You are brave. <laughs> the likelihood of dying in battle plus a hundred percent. Necessarily always a good thing. So self-declared divine right. Yup. See if that's worth have one day to fuel the place. Or go tie the plain holy soldier suit. Join me and we'll enact Allah's will together. Spend 50 p or no, join me. Join me as one of the knights. Soldier still practicing battle for Took them upon himself to continue field exercises. <laughs> Hello, Kayla. Where's the cats at court DLC? Unfortunately, we don't have that one just yet. Which is a shame. We could really do with having some little cats and dogs actually physically around. But hello, welcome to dinner. Hope you're doing well today. See, overworked soldiers, advantage to <laughs> search continues. Okay, let's continue on on this one. Okay, hardly a display of military, but gained a new perspective. Valuable exercise, one martial life. Yes. Yes, I admit when we started uh, uh, the Royal Court DLC two years ago, jeez. Well, I was a little bit disappointed that if you had a pet, you can actually see them in the royal court. But there is um, a mod that I was running with when I was doing private games, which actually allows you to have more of a menagerie. That's a little bit of extra stuff in there, but still, you don't really get to uh, actually see the animals. Here's a small game. Well, a lot of prestige. The Anna Hunt. 
be the one. Okay, so either one of those is going to be fine. Gang. Hello there. Much more prestige. 75 gold, we can afford that. Hello there, Apartin. How are you doing? <laughs> Hope your day's going well so far. You've come in just in time for us to hunt down stag. Hopefully. 54% chance. I think that's actually the highest I've seen a success chance just straight from the start. Okay, so seek the stag, middling and mediocre. Or seek a hyena. No, I think we'll go with the stag because we did get the notification about that. Okay, some people hunting and hope where they shouldn't be. So punished poachers, hold taxes, what's your opinion? Well, this is active hunt success chance slightly better. 50 50, the animal is fine along lines for their life. Let's go for that one. No, didn't think so. And we have our second child. Only got uh, level one. Only got the level one intelligence game. And oh dear. Uh oh, oh god. What's happened here? Um, right, okay, that's an interesting thing. So, fellow traveller went on ahead of the group. I catch up, I find him who a man. Hugging an arrow from or commoner's chest. Um, okay, this is the only one that's not going to gain us stress. So, 40 stress. 40 stress. 40 stress. <laughs> Oh dear, yeah, we'll go for the one that doesn't get stressed because I do try and arrange that so we don't get stress unnecessarily going against our traits. Uh, relatively fine. We received an interesting job offer. Last week was dedicated galleries. Congratulations, and I hope it works out well for you. I do hope it works out well for you. What does peasant justice get us? Pop the opinion. Okay, go for that one. So, clearing downward is the covert, perfect place to form a bowline and wait the stag driven thither by so a great suggestion. Attempt. That is more perilous, success chance decreases. Okay. Like that. <laughs> Thank you, PP. First person who's shown genuine worry. I really hope that, that means that these events have only happened recently to you and you haven't had a bunch of people commenting about that for a month with no genuine about it. Uh, give me a moment. I really need to. Uh, Getting a bit Uh, happened like five days ago, the throwing the things away. Okay, so it's thankfully not been a situation where it's been, or it happened a good while. But still, five days. I would have hoped that someone else would have offered concern and sympathy about it. And it pass him, head librarian at the research center. Of prosthetics and rehabilitation sounds like a good opportunity it damn well does that damn well does so i will say uh job offer 
Okay, so it's not even like an interview for the place, it is a genuine full on job offer. So I would again say congratulations are passing. Hope it suits you well and hope it uh, provides me and more years of gainful enjoyment for you. And Bobakiss, Dad's the only other one that did well. Thank goodness for your dad. Thank goodness for your dad. Yes, it is fantastic news considering all that's been happening for you in... I don't even know how long it's been for you, but having such a brilliant job opportunity is going to, I hope, be absolutely fantastic for you and your well-being. And like I said, many, many years of gainful employment for you. <laughs> Where's the party and am I invited? <laughs> hmm, good question. Good question. We're gonna have to plan something, aren't we? We're definitely gonna have to plan something. Okay, so apparently after having run into some poachers, we're now running into just general uh, peasants. So which one successful? This is 15 gold. Yeah, we'll say a generous donation. 15 gold will be fine. Okay, watch for the stag from our concealed bowline. The brown buck suddenly leaves the clearing ahead and flailing, bounding straight towards us in terror. Okay, so. 45% chance to be shot, 11% chance random participants. 43% chance nothing happens. Um, is else 48 10 41 so 2 percent. Uh, basically, <laughs> stag pales onto a hail of arrows, gain 20 stress because we're diligent, or we say run away <laughs> and spend 150 piety. Honestly, I think it's gonna say everyone let loose your arrows. And there we go, we got it. So I'll keep a memento. We'll become the owner of Stag and Prestige Bane and Cook Castle. Or I give it to our newborns well, not quite newborn son. But yes, we'll keep that as a memento. So we do gain back 20 prestige, uh, 20 legitimacy. So uh, the 200 we lost from Mount Nobody, we've uh, gained 10% of that back. And we also got Dangerous Beast Slain for 10 years. Loss loses 24 stress, gains the straight star. Okay. That's going to give us a little bit of a benefit and a bonus. Guardianship, no decline. Okay, apparently uh, Mount Damavand was a... Okay, I don't know why we suddenly got all of those. Maybe it's just because we're returning to our capital city. And it is wrestling and... Bother with that one. Stag and equip that, get a tiny bit more all of that good stuff. Big control there. So we do still have Gilan here that we could potentially get. Put that down. So this is four. So we'll just say. Actually, 54% she is convinced that nah, she's doubtful. Okay, it was worth a shot. I really think anything was going to happen because uh, this is male only inheritance and 
you're still not married. Your regent is your brother, and your brother is not married either. <laughs> okay, um, that's going to be interesting because who's going to inherit after that? It's going to be this random person. Who doesn't seem to be related in any way. And is, okay, it would fall to someone in this area then. Very bizarrely. Or the same person that was checked on. Yeah. So that would all go into the Abbasids. We're not careful. We need to get that under our control. For the good of the realm, of course. For the good of the realm. Can't we skip uh, falling under stranger's control? Put in this. Put us in depth. Gonna be able to fight or declare war for that area that need uh, oh, okay. Dangerous faction hasn't about the eleven percent military. We'll be able to deal with that. Um, I'll go for Bellum just them um, next point actually. Uh, do I see made of money? We just spent eighty one gold getting a claim we cannot afford to give you 75 gold fortunately cannot afford to give you 75 gold for the okay got 66 gold most tempted if we if we did an independence war because we have all three pieces of territory in this emerald be able to just straight up usurp it. I think we would. I think we would, but it would also put us in a bit of a dangerous position because at the moment we obviously have our lead to kind of huddle and if we're able to take all of the territory ourselves, that could be a good option. Okay, what is your personality? Tent black guy. A dishonorable but very generous. Cheer him up after the training is over. Yeah, I think that's a better one. He doesn't seem overly motivated to increase his mili military strength. Capability. Safe and control. Annoying. Oh. Oh no 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 no. We do not want to distick. We do not want to distick. Uh, we don't want zealous either. Ambitious. Yes. Yes. That's what we want. Okay. So, oh, I was going to say, it said our wife was pregnant. There's the baby. Oh, there. Name the baby after us. Oh. So we're slowly, as we go down, so no genetic traits, level one genetic trait, level two genetic trait. Probably should find these kids some um, potential spouses at all. Okay, there's... One here, Amazonia. Holy heck. They are actually part of at least some kind of dynasty. Are nine years old. I think an eight is probably a bit too um, much of an age gap for you. Is it worth waiting? I think it may be worth waiting. We could 
know what? I'm going to marry you or betroth you. Uh -huh. I'm going to betroth you. you. And then I'm going to betroth you to you. And that one, then at all, it will get inherited and it might intensify. So we'll get that one. Thumbs. Okay, there goes. Isn't bolt. Quick. <laughs> Alliance formed a simple ah. Yes, because you've got the um opposite of the uh genius trait there. Uh fifty tree. And you're obviously just gonna have anyone around for any alliances. Easy and you obviously so ransom you for a hook. Um no. actually you know your mill or your prowess isn't two Yeah, I'll recruit you actually because you be a good enough. Yeah, your answer then. Good work. Particularly. And I know I probably should have a look at creating the um, um, military board. Why am I blanking on? I blank the um. They okay, distribute them among my courtiers. We don't want any yes. The option which allows you to create like a knighthood title. What is that called? Why can't I do it? Is it because I'm a count? I can't do it until I'm a duke or something. I cannot remember. <laughs> Hello there, senior Emango. Hi, bringing in the puns as usual. What do you call a cow with no legs? Round beef. Oh boy, how are you doing? Hope things are going well with you. They seriously, he's somewhere, but I cannot remember where the hell it is. No, it's not here. We don't have a world court because we're not a because that's a We really should be able to have them as a duke. It seriously must be because I'm a count and not a duke. That's the only thing I can think of. Seriously, the only thing I can think of. Oh, because our armies are still raised. That would explain it. Would explain it. Um, vastly inferior, because obviously it's counting allies. Just gain 5%. Add and wife is pregnant. Need to get quite a few children. I will get you to develop capital for me. Okay, pondering the education of my son is he really the right. Yes, it is. A uh, varied skill set is a benefit. There we go, we can join the hunt. So, what do we have here? Dry lands and unrest. So, how is that not going to do anything? So, dry lands. There's a. Ultra. Oh, that's an interesting one that I haven't seen yet. 
Save danger minus 52. Yeah, mercenary guards, trouble speed and trouble safety. Is that just not going to do anything because... Ah, yeah, that's a lot better. Let's go join the hunt for some... Time has come for us to depart. So, of course, by participating in... We are going to be able to hopefully get some... Okay, so a group of armed magi walking in the opposite are lashing at pretty flames with snuffing them out. Hands hover where wearily over their weapon. The priests us round them up and snuff out. This is an hundred piety. Say, oh no, <laughs> I was gonna say you could try and shelter with us, but nope, we got the bad out. So, do not quite see what we're hunting yet? Hunt a hyena. Peril and prestige are both middling. Okay, and nestling, so we could potentially get ourselves a hunting raptor. We can give it to. Interesting note, we'll keep it ourselves. We might be able to actually use that in the next. We're attempting to the hyena with a spear. Perilous. Just have to wait, and no, it is gone. 8.5% chance. Yes. yes. That would have been a very, very good dice roll if that had happened. There we go, every participating guest gains me. No, I'm not a uh, wet mouse. Stop sending so many notifications to me. Um, okay, anyway. You need for uh, I think we'll go for Oh. Yeah, we've got enough troops or not. Do that. Move this closer and raise all our troops. Cross and fight, fight, fight. Uh, okay, this is what I was worried about. Because I said no to this in one test run, and then I basically got told, yeah, I can't trust you with, like, or ruling over this area. I'm going to take it away from you. I said no. We went to war. I got imprisoned. Titles all revoked. Game over. So we will accept this. Theodism. However... I did notice that it actually still keeps our previous secret religion as our secret religion so we don't suddenly swap our private religion or secret religion that one actually does stay as it was which is a good thing oh hang on okay you suddenly got a load of troops from somewhere hello help help run away run away I was going to say this is going to be the fourth born son that has the genius trait nope just no genetic traits run away I swear you didn't have as many troops as that when I just saw you ah because he hired mercenaries I should have checked you up Gold stash. Get them. Gold pad. Okay, there we go. It's our um, allies coming up to help us. Um. Okay, what war is? Oh, it's a raid. Someone coming into raid. So, 
We're locked in. Unfortunately, I didn't see that in time. Going to be part of that. Um, I kind of need help. Where are you going? You're looking like you've been defeated. I haven't. Oh my goodness, okay, you're, um... Okay, thankfully that was at 76%. <laughs> Okay, you know we were a secret follower. Kind of at a stalemate at the moment. Ah, there we go. Okay, you're coming back. Bye. Okay. Okay, we're coming back. They're coming back now. They are actually genuinely going to come and help us. Better bloody help us. Okay, can I tell you? Nope, apparently I can't. So let's moving help. It worked. Great, so we're in a stalemate now. get a better com I mean it's us after rain expert or holy warrior 37 versus 8 we'll try the 18 oh there we go they're finally moving in now okay network of merchants let's try that one and nope army's lacking provision which is going to be bad thing Apparently, odds are even. This one doesn't look very even to me. Okay, so we've got either trusting or pickle here. Which one's better for diplomacy? Plus two. Pickle is also plus two, minus two stewardship. I really don't want to get in reduced stewardship if you're going to be. Uh, is enemy hostile scheme best chance plus 15 percent is not great but it's the better option vaguely speaking okay good that's brought us back up to uh seven percent positive and they're just going to go and come back in and just yo-yo off us very okay, kiss okay you've got a real knee slapper oh dear Whenever one of you says something like that, whenever one of you says something like that, I'm prepared for the absolute worst pun I can imagine. Okay, here we go. Where do bad rainbows go? Prism. It's a light sentence and gives them time to react, a uh, time to reflect. <laughs> I'm not even sure I could be that genuinely a not. Because that one actually does take a bit of brain power. You do actually have to obviously understand prism, reflections, light scattering and all of that one. So that's not too bad, but it's still a pun. It's still a pun, so... And, of course, the one person, the one child we get, who cannot inherit at all, gets genius. What's a liar's favourite cereal? Cap'n Crunch. Oh dear. I think... <laughs> I'm not sure I even want to know anymore. I'm not even sure who I want to know anymore. You saw the cringe. You can feel the cringe. 
good. Whoever win the cringe, may the cringe embarrass you. Because that was atrocious. Yeah, you're just going to keep ping-ponging back off us. And it says that we will likely lose, but I don't know. The only thing I can think of why it's saying that is because... Oh. Oh. That's, um... Okay, that's an interesting one. Uh, so war declared, but almost immediately you vanished without a trace. Okay, last one. What job title is like saying boy twice? Counting down, three, two, one. <laughs> Male man. Man. all right okay that's it that's it we're done here we're done here people we're done here <laughs> okay genuinely we've only been live for over an hour i would not do something like that <laughs> oh boy oh boy i swear the only person who loves telling me puns more than my husband is you. Because despite me being a VTuber, you can still see and you can still feel the cringe and resentment coming through the monitor. When it almost counter efficiency plus 25%, pretty much got four in the bag. Go, but it can't help to have a little bit of extra. There we go. So we now own four different bits of territory. Apparently, we had a plague turn up nearby. Ooh. Okay. So we've got measles hanging around here. Not going to be good for our kids because apparently that is uh, fairly dangerous. Okay. So this hacking into there okay you've got so many puns please i beg of you save some for other streams please i cannot take much more i cannot take much more <laughs> i oh boy Mind you, I was watching um, or oh, Quill 18's uh, stream VODs. He was playing uh, Keeper RL and someone came in and dropped a bunch of uh, puns on him. So it was, uh, what's up a mummy's favourite genre of music? Rap? Um, what do you call an old mummy? A tumor and I went to a dance party with mummies but it was all a shambles so there you go three mummy related puns feel free to use them because I know you will get some enjoyment out of those <laughs> I d you do know this is a clip you mean you're actually going to clip me saying puns? You're actually going to clip me saying puns and go, See? They're not that bad. They're not that bad if PT is saying them. Of course. <laughs> okay, let me just have a look at this. 88%. That's how blackmail works. I will say them next time in the most deadpan, bored manner imaginable. It will be Marvin, the paranoid android, level of depressing, dull, lifeless. Okay, so 88%. Yeah, let's try that one. Games new focus. Listen to some 
past. We'll attempt to translate the older scroll. 55, 45. 45% still means, yeah, gaining stress. 85%. We can afford at least a little bit of stress. We'll try and push forwards. Okay, study the battle of Red Cliffs. Maximum battle world plus six for 20 minutes. Or we'll study ancient. Study the battle. Because that will be good. So I'm not going to bother getting a weak hook because we have a uh, weak because we are family. So this is Gregarious. Should be a good diplomacy guest plus two. Weedy is minus two so we don't want that one and it's um uh sinful. Lustful could be fun but yes we'll keep Gregarious for you. Fourth son, is there anyone good for you? Four year old with a beautiful fate. And I do notice that actually doing all of these marriages for your children does not seem to have any impact on your own legitimacy because we are slowly crawling back. Yeah, we're almost at three. Almost at three now. So we need 240 legitimacy for that one. And obviously we're still expected at level 1. We've still got a good bonus to that one. Anyway, I can get our gold levels back up. I say just as we have um, yeah, a couple of prisoners. You know what? You can just go. You're not worth anything. I just go. Okay, so ah. Uh, okay, so your diplomacy as well. That's fine. Four years old. We need diplomacy. I can make you a learning character. And who's the best one? Um, who is also blind. So that's going to be a fun one. Getting a load of diplomacy children at the moment. Who's probably quite good? Our wife. And we don't have a trait just yet. Here you are. You first start with some cringier stuff and then bring in the good ones. Uh huh. So you get in the mood. Uh huh. Whatever you say. Whatever you say. They did. Don't want that, do we? Of course, because we've changed religion, our court imam now has 24. We are 1027. Piety, uh, not piety, prestige. Oh, you've actually finally gotten married to a 43 year old. Great. So she's got like one year to pop out a kid and stop this whole realm from just descending into chaos. Because you still not remarried. Your daughter has married, but apparently she is um been accused of decadence and she's had two girls. Twins actually. She's had twin girls. Your grasp on warfare. So teach a flexible skill. Or leave it to generals. No, I want to learn. That one um, for uh, young son. No. no, we won't want that one. Very much. Like that one, that was not what I wanted to press. We don't want any travel options because we won't be uh, traveling any. 
Very nice. Yeah. So we can go for but of course it is. It's 75 gold. So great opinion today. Yeah, let's do all of that. So let's try and get a bit of prestige from this event. Obviously, even if we get enough prestige, we're still gonna have to wait to actually get our funds back to uh, get our liege's title. Hey, okay. love this feast, all my compliments to the host. So 150 prestige versus household efforts. Is Vassal and Courtian guest opinion of five years? Yes, I'm not too worried about our wife's opinion of us because she is at 100. Ooh. The other guests are laughing and chattering in the noisy hall, making it hard to focus on the sentiment. I draw lines and engagements in the greasy sludge as I think of ways to catch the very battle. It seems like it might work on a real battlefield. I think that a bowl of gore could help expand your understanding of martial lifestyle. Ooh. Ah. My impatient chancellor is sensitive to almond. I sadly forgot to tell the cook. A bad reaction to food, severe penalty. Or his face as I save him from the food is definitely too. Yes, I think I prefer that one. <laughs> so, chance to five there. Every guest with at least one trait in common with you gains 20 AP. Minus 1.2. Yeah, so that would be. Bit over a year and a half. No, I'll take the lose 65 stress from that one, to be honest. Okay, what right does Shekar Argvan thinks she has to claim that my ideas of warfare are misguided? Seriously, I have not seen this. <laughs> I have not seen this before. Huh? Discussions on strategy for five years, maximum battle world plus five and army movement speed plus 10%. What? Seriously, I have had all of these things in place, but I've not seen a feast increasing your uh, martial lifestyle experience. Okay, every noble worth their sort will know my magnificence is unrivaled. Okay, so another 20 stress loss and great banquet for five years. So development, growth and pop. That's also another 20 legitimacy, and I think that Yes, is going to be enough to be able to claim his title. So this is an unpressed claim, so we are going to have to be careful. But we are only 34 years old. We are only 34 years old. So he deserved to know the Lord of Wisdom's power. Yes, 95% he's convinced. And yes, he has our second. So we've got at least one more character that we can potentially uh, declare our secret religion be our faith if something unfolds to our current character. It would be a shame to lose all of that uh, lovely prestige on an unpressed claim that we won't actually be able to get. But we are also legitimacy level 3. So can I swear I could see your legitimacy level was there it is it's right there okay it's slightly higher than ours i did get an achievement for actually claiming your legis title well your legitimacy was higher than theirs which last i looked 0.1 percent of people got okay right your brother has finally had a child had a son that means the succession is slightly, slightly more stable. Okay, tax things. Yep, and they'll need to help you. Sadly go for. Okay, so that expires in a year. Fine. We've got 
four and a bit years for that one. Still got 18 for that, and we are still going to have four years for that. So 2.6, that's just over 30 gold a year, plus whatever random events we So I think we're actually going to have this as an option when we go and claim our Legis title. And then obviously this one's going to go away by then. And then this one, unless we take unless we take 20 years waiting to save up, we will definitely have that one available. Um, let's see, challenge. Dean versus 20 prowess. So 62% chance we win. Nope, we lose. Oh well. I yield. Well fought. It is well fought. Okay, just double checking. I did get our daughter betrothed and that was matrilineal as well because we do not want that genius trait to fall out of the family. Do not want that genius trait to fall out of the family dynasty if I can help it. Okay, you're no longer in debt, but you are also ill. Our son is a level 4 diplomat. Nice, unfortunately we're going to have 9 years to wait before his betrothed becomes of age. And of course, speaking of our second son, so Rostam is attempting to... Oh, okay, you're quite ill. You are quite ill. Um, so this is Brave. Versus copper. It's diplomacy plus one. But grid decay. Zealous? No. So grey. No, actually, I think we'll give you Carl. Because you're not going for a military martial education. So, plus also getting brave. Don't want to. <laughs> Reduce the number of heirs we have just yet. Don't want to do that just yet, if we can help it. We'll bump this up to speed 5 while we're waiting. Getting off the land. Capacity plus 200% won't hurt. Definitely won't. Ah! Okay, this might be why. This might actually be why we had those events during because we were trying to learn a new um martial tactic. So it's nice to press stops being your mentor, loses fifty opinion. I have almost got a two thirds potential to get it. And we do. So we now have flexible uh, so we already had Holy Warrior, which is going to help us if we do decide to uh, declare our secret religion. And Flexible Leader is going to go brilliantly. I may or may have not already shared the puns with the world. Allegedly. Okay, when you say you've shared them, does that mean you've told people it through text and or your own voice or do you mean that you've posted up the clip somewhere where loads and loads of people can laugh at me because one of those is significantly better than the other one one of those is significantly better than the other option you didn't post the clip you just told the jokes okay <laughs> okay that's good how did they react? Hopefully with a um, brilliant groan and roll of the eyes to those. <laughs> they laughed their arse off. <laughs> okay, so... Perfect increased by 10. It's fine, we don't need to worry too much about that because it's a religion we're not going to be with. For too long, hopefully. Make sure 
Okay, we do have like double the amount of gold. We're gaining about the same amount a month. Did you expect anything else from a Discord arcade gaming focused server? <laughs> We're playing Knights of the Wind with four people. Ah. Okay, knowing that, no, I'm not surprised that everyone laughed their ass off at those puns now. Knowing that, I'm not surprised. Okay, so this is honest. Plus four, uh, plus two diplomacy. Arbitrary. Patient. Okay. Yeah, um, this son is not expendable. <laughs> he is not expendable. I know I've got four sons, but he's got a level two, a level two, uh, genetic trait. I really, really would like to, uh, avoid anyone dying an untimely death before their <laughs> they're saying untimely and before their time does kind of mean the same thing so pretend i didn't treat myself we've got some boars poetry will Try this one again. Work of merchants. We can actually gain 50 gold here with no penalty. I will take that very much. Now, you are obviously allied to your brother. The military strength is going to be similar. But this is why we've got 200 gold saved up. This is why. We've got 200 gold saved up, so we're going to raise all of our... I mean, here. Those ones are going to call in Atlas. Designate a guardian for our daughter here, who is apparently fitted in injury. So hopefully she should be a very, very good character coming for I was going to say, okay, I have no idea where these uh, characters are necessarily going to go. Do you have... Okay, just keeping an eye. Okay, you're heading all the way over there. We're trying to siege this one, but it's going to take absolutely forever. We do not have enough siege weapons. Just quick size of those because the 50 gold that we just skimmed off the top is um right back here up the speed back up a bit and just so we can get a little bit more. yeah most of the hunt position revoked i'm not surprised Ah, fault level is too high. That's why it's taking us quite a while. Okay, you got one of our um, children. Going to be unfortunate, but hopefully, should be able to siege down the without too much trouble. Oh, okay. Yes, that was what I was worried about. That uh, you were suddenly going to. Honestly, I think that actually helps us out. As of 500, obviously we've lost a few troops. But still, means we are now technically about as strong as we can. So again, hopefully, push our way through all of these territories without too much trouble. Thousand. So, okay, we are reinforcing a few siege weapons. Okay, there's 1,800 coming back into that. Okay, our daughter's educator died. We can't really give her a new educator. No, we can't. But we can give one to you. You're being educated in. 
Yes, which is a shame because our oh, amount there had a really good, had really, really high luck. It says it's going to be about even. That is us leading the troops. Okay. Let's honestly just go to the capital. If we can't catch you, we will be able to just... There we go. Oh, okay. That was a huge chunk of troops that just disappeared. Uh, uh, how's that measles doing? Okay, that disappeared. We do have tusk boils somewhere else, but once again, it's not in our territory, so I don't care. At least not for now. Doing fine enough that we don't worry about getting any um lessons in. This is going well. Much better than I was anticipating. Much better than I was anticipating. Because I had a couple of games that did fail around this stage. Okay, so this is... Our Chancellor knows too much about him. Um, weak hook, blackmail, secret faith on me until 886. That's like six months. We're fine. We don't need to worry about all that stress. We're fine. Watch me in four and a half months die because that person murdered me, but <laughs> but we will just uh, go with it for now. Well, he knows too much. Apparently, apparently our character thinks he does. Yes, but I don't think he does. Welcome in. Hope your day's going well today. You a well. I say long time Crusader Kings 3 player slash viewer. It's only been out three years, but that's still a decent amount of time. Surprised we're only losing 0.6 gold a month, though. They see lost. How on earth are you learning the Scythian language through observation? Get in prison! Oh, okay. Apparently, you are an important person. Oh, no. Sorry, no, my mind's uh, making that up. That's not because you're an important person, that's because we lost De Delam. There's our secret faith hook has expired. Okay, we should be able to de-siege this in no uh, So yours, three, max three months left, max 59 days. But yes, we may not be able to get over here in time to stop you sieging it, but... Gesundheit. Apologies if you had that. 100% uh, chance Jamshid is convinced. Yes, we will. Head over here. Lee does say we'll be in. You no longer have a court physician. A poor. I guess we actually need to find someone that yeah, killed in a siege. A shame. <laughs> so we have you, 15 learning, um, physician, novice physician, herbalist, versus 15. I was going to say, what's the difference between them? You've got a star on that and you don't. Well, you're 50 gold, you're 15. Good versus excellent. I might as well just go for the good one because you can learn. You're only 32. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, we gained wounded. That's... Oh, there we go. Lost it. Easy come, easy go. Whereabouts are you ahead? You're going to be heading back to the capital to do it? Yes. Definitely. No, nope. we might past it. Okay. So let's see. Where's going to be the best place for us to head? No, 
that may come through fight you drop your desieging of that and move up here to siege this one and then hopefully we'll have just enough territory to actually declare a victory okay apparently we are attrition one percent a month that's going to be fine Or de sieging that, that's probably not going to take you that long. Got that one, we are a 97%. Come on. The uh, more time I spend with my man, the more his overwhelming stress becomes. A really? Are you that stressed? You're inescapable. You're 23! You're 23. You're taking hashish. What on earth has been going on with you? What on earth has been going wrong? Okay, there's our um, second son, level 3. Returns to the Legion's Court. Yes, Delhi in prison! There we go, 100%. Hey, enforced demand. Gain a hundred legitimacy, become independent, gain the seeded em emirate. Not empire, emirate. And there we go. Being the light touches belongs to your kingdom. Okay, so. Untaxed vassals are clan vassals. Fine. Fiction. Taxpayers and therefore not automatically assign them. So that should be working. So, disband all of those troops. Moving up in the world, achievement unlocked. Let me have a look at that because uh, you probably aren't going to see that. Or is that actually. Yeah. Okay, right, that's an achievement I've already got. It's just uh, registering in the game that I've also got it. Moving up in the world, increase rank. Obviously, we have gone from Count to Duke. Apparently, that means we get a nice fancy hat. Um, they pay some. Two. The demand comes through. Pay the ransom for you as well. 25 gold for both kids. One of our prisoners. Do that. 30 gold. Yes, we can do that. Um, You're actually pretty good. I will recruit you. And... I was going to say, is like you've got the novice physician trait, but your learning's only 5. You're not going to be that good. So you... I will just release because there's no point in keeping you down. Okay, independence faction. Independence from the, the. Who is this? Ah, yes, you. Okay, what can I do? Apparently, nothing because already considering a proposal from us. Get our troops back. Uh, you've got 57 gold. A. <laughs> How on earth can you have 104% military power if you've got 93 troops and your ally has 101 and I've got 912? Um, Gabe, I think your mathematics is not quite um, correct there. Thankfully, can send an ultimatum in 15. So we'll be able to get our money up. Oh, oh no someone else has just joined someone else has just joined so do we want improved fences or do a mock battle yes we'll do the mock battle
Okay, go through the sewers. Attack progresses very well. Ninety-two. Yes. We'll take the uh, higher percentage of doing well versus doing it quickly. Seventy-seven. Ninety. But unstoppable. And our enemies will never stand a chance. There we go. So not only do we get the improved defences regardless. So gain a martial lifestyle perk. Then we could go for Sathas. Which adds to our potential for a siege or being able to siege down places. Okay, right. <sighs> Let's have a look at all of this. So, 18 learn. And best intrigue is, yes, court position. You can offer a hostage. I don't want to worry. Brother can marry because apparently, yeah. Uh, his previous wife, what happened? Dying in captivity, okay. Hey. If you're a wife and this is how ah. But a shame. So are there any characters with a good trait? No, and apparently you didn't even manage to get a child before she died either. I'm gonna marry this random person then. Apparently I have two houses, low control county. I can declare wars. Titles can be created. So a duchy. Powerful vassals. Demand council position. Okay, are either of you any good? Because honestly, that's the thing I care about. More. Okay, so you're 17. 24, but hopefully if I put... Fisher. We'll uh, eat that a tiny bit and worst comes to worst. Okay. Actually join my side. Now I'm missing 59 prestige and it's only an 11% chance for you will join it. You I can put this. Fortunately minus 24% because uh, yeah we kind of went to walk with you. We did uh child so we could actually <laughs> we could actually get betrothed and have an alliance that way yeah you know what you know what go for it <laughs> you know what we'll do that way that's actually increased it to plus six. <laughs> well that is brilliant brilliant and uh the last person okay so we've got a hook on you a favour for one and a half years but then we could put you in position that only gets you down to minus 74 no alliance um fortunately you've only got boys so we can't really do anything with that one however it's... oh my goodness okay um this one is the worst Looks a bit, yeah, four. Go with that one. So, yeah, eight years, two years, 29 days, five years. It actually could be worth here. Get that one. I see. see how that one goes. We'll see how that one goes. Hopefully. Should just be done and quick like yes there we go then we can put you there because all of these will hopefully start to a little bit yeah like plus point 70 minus point 70 yeah monthly progress plus not 0.9 0.38 Yes, it is uh, best to put you there. Then if we hover over this, 1.16. Yes, that does increase it quite a lot. It does increase it quite a lot. Doing 3%. 
And of course, because we got that alliance with you, we can no longer start or join a faction. So that not nice and easy. In our arms, we can actually get a third one. So we have light camel, the light heavy camel cavalry. These differ, so these have um, screen better option. Wider. These are better here, so I think we'll actually create um, you. Second best place for you. So a better place for you. Not really. Uh, oh yes, right, yes. Um, unfortunately, she's ill, but we'll just have to deal with that. You are two years off from being of eligible age. Oh, okay, right. I did not notice that. I did not notice that the empires around us have um, kind of shattered. So that's actually very, very good for us because obviously we want these duchies, but we're also going to want the king here and potentially go down into Persia. So if we flick back, so we've got the Ottoman there, and then Tahirid, a bit of it, Ugus. Let me have a look. Okay, so what happened here? I do not know. Oh, okay. Good thing you chose different colours. Because the ogres and the ogres ill would otherwise be very, very, very... Um, distracting is the wrong word. I could easily get those very <coughs> confused. So thinking about it, if someone is red, been red colourblind... They probably still confuse those two because those would be, yeah, they are pretty similar in saturation and the like. So anyway, 2,800. Um, so, I can't even see that. It's like you don't even have any parents here. You had one who was unlanded. So how on earth all of these people ended up with them? Um... Okay, I think this may actually be like the result of an independence war looking at this. Uh, okay, hostages, independence war. Okay, so that explains your one. Alliances through marriage. Conquest, peasant uprising, independence. Okay, so the Abbasids might actually fracture even time. Um, yes, hello. <laughs> uh, what are you wanting? Let me just have a look. So you're wanting that one little bit of land. Which, honestly, I could probably just uh, give up if I really wanted to. So we can make a couple of rally points just because we have quite a um, large amount of land right now. So raise all there. We can call in our ally for 50 troops. I think we're fine. I think we'll be fine on that one game. Oh, hang on a minute. Is there a plague? And no, because it would show it was nearby. I think that's just because it's, yeah, desert mountains. And it's that colour. Okay, um, somehow I don't think we're going to be able to, to uh, fight you off. That's going to be a fight problem. And there's no way we're going to make our way down to Peacemaker before ends 
Okay, so we're in drylands here. That is drylands, desert mountains. I can't even remember who you were. Honestly, I just have so many marriages and a lot more. Okay, it says chances are even. Better army commander, more commander traits, higher quality, more men at arms. Uh, negative, they've got more soldiers. Uh, if you say so. If you say so. I don't trust that. I don't trust that the chances are going to be even. Nah, nah, look at that. Even though we're hammering down there soldiers we are holy hell what do you have there holy hell all soldiers what the heck wow okay so strategist gets us diplomacy enemy fatal casualties causes river straits without advantage yes seeing as that will give us a benefit right now all such as a brutal on the pursuit best men at arms for stack wipes uh indeed yeah i think we lost about 700 troops in that battle let me have a look yeah <laughs> almost exactly what i said about 700 troops 674 is about 700 oh so, ouch 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 but i did say they only want one county so we can surrender that without too much trouble Unfortunately, it's going to tank our legitimacy just because uh, we're going to be losing all of these battles, I think, honestly. Um, okay, so you gain the contested title, which is just that one bit of land. The title will be lost. That's fine. The good news is I think actually lost us um, one of our uh, vassals who really did not like us. Yeah, because he's no longer a ruler, we'll just um, make that betrothal. Thank you very much. Okay, that has uh, done us a bit of a problem. Um, 24%. Trying for a moment gold. Invest gold. We don't have gold. Book titles, we can't do that because he has we have a truce with him. So for four years, does that mean yeah, that does mean he can still attack us annoyingly. He can still attack us. Has been fine. Uh, is there any of these that actually is levy? Uh, garrison size and levy reinforcement rate plus 23%. Yes, we'll go with that one. Thank you. Okay, night effect of this minute, almost damage and toughness. Yep, we'll do that when we flip over. Control will be fine. Select probably going to be um fortunately we're gonna to have to wait for these to uh stop retreating before we can expand them wait seven i'm thing you are on these ugh this is gonna be a pain Okay, military power 90%. Us. So if we're quick, if we're quick, we might be able to do something. Okay, 805 versus your 980. I'm really just waiting for the pop up here. I'm really just waiting for the pop up here. This is going to be... I almost thought that was going to be it. There we go. Yes, I have no choice. You'll become independent. No, I won't. Um, 
go rally the troops and had one here unfortunately <laughs> in enemy land can't do that one we can move this one raise all here five Okay, so that was our Chancellor. Good. Okay, thank you. Better one. Thank you very much for that. Oh boy. Okay, one of our lands is under that's fine. Um it's been five months, seven months. Oh yes, I can see their wars, I know not actually go up against them with 800 troops versus 3,000 team. I appreciate your um, enthusiasm and confidence in me, but that is... Okay, 871 versus 975. We are both losing here. Just want to check are we yes that is us okay okay you are heading towards us but it does say we're probably going to win oh my goodness oh how how? How did we do that? We had like 75% of the troops, but apparently quality over quantity in this case. Quality over quantity. So I siege that one down three months, nine months, okay, so it's going to take you we can siege this down and hopefully move across hey, who wants to get married yes fine i'm sure i pretty much set that up earlier when we were embroiled in a ton of wars okay there's that one we now have the numbers advantage we now have the numbers advantage the good thing about this revolt is i'm going to be able to stick him in prison be able to stick him in prison and we're just going to be able to take all of his titles away from him that's the one good thing i have with all of this fired fine okay, apparently i can ransom someone just double checking so do not trust the game do not trust the game <laughs> at times to actually tell me hey you can ransom this person i promise it won't decrease your war score if you ransom them out oh 85 gold okay didn't even need to bother ransoming that person out then just got that a okay, six month and 51 day by some miracle we have won this uh, correction by some miracle we are probably going to win this don't want to get my hopes up are we going to catch you before you move out we are so yeah even look at that so pikemen countering opponents camel riders countering opponents pikemen deals 90 percent damage due to being countered deals 43 percent damage due to being countered but fighting in favorable terrain somehow even with these negatives we're still outpacing you okay this is our second son uh level three in uh learning which isn't bad is not bad oh you've got 1200 troops now i'd better finish this off quickly then better try and finish this off quick did you bring an ally in yes with 80 troops although a vassal in our 
who I don't think know you've just um to grab some mercenaries, yes. Well that's not good because you've only got twelve gold. I've got 144. And this potentially could still go my way. This is why I didn't want to guarantee and say we were going to win this. Both can marry. Yep. Okay, yeah, so this is potentially or even. But yes, this may be where we want to uh, try and consider maybe bringing in... Not. 97% and that is enough for us to win. Holy. Oh, you imprison all rebellious vassals and gain a title revocation reason against each of them. The independence faction is disbanded and its members cannot join factions for 10 years. Give me your titles. Apparently I can't do that because we have a truce. 22 months. Okay, you can stew in the dungeon until then. Stew in the dungeon until then. What is this? A grand tournament? That is just one event. Pretty much this early in the game, they're just only going to have one event. Yeah, I can ransom you out for gold. Ransom you out for. Oh, no, no. Um, Wait, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that one. Um, You're okay, but you're 59 years old. You're 15. That you can go as well. Just get out of my dungeon. Just go. I'm not going to worry about that. Um, no, I need him to remain in prison. Thank you. Uh, okay, right. So, see, he has quite a lot of realm under his control. So we're going to need to manage that. Um, let's see. So we can appoint Port Chronicler. Can we do anything? Search for legend. Every year you have a random chance to gain a legend's cost per month, 0.1 gold. Higher levels of aptitude is the chance of this happening. A extol domestic legend and commend legend award and the standard one regular duty. Okay, I will uh, see what happens then. Get a legend. Oh, great deed for Alf Sigurd. Someone has a completed legend. Legend protagonist, High Chiefess Wagnhilda Filch. Ooh. Okay, so what legend get yeah, there? So, effective modifiers, banning. Yeah, a few bearing the name of Alf Sigurd have done so for their dynasty as King Dyer of Ruthenia. Ooh, all who promote this legend benefit equity as of the folk. Every reinforcement with each same faith up to 5%. That's 5%. So, Open Chronicle. The legend of High Chiefess Rag Ragnhilda of Hel Helch is as great and large as the world for her deeds of unparalleled. Upon hearing vague rumours of the vague land, Ragnhilda set her heart to accomplish a difficult endeavour. Ragnhilda's legend culminates in a marvellous adventure. The great deeds of arms were such that all kings had wondered thereof, and many nobles and commoners came to her encounter, for they wished to see the legend in the flesh. She went on, and with great bravery, King Di of Ruthenia commanded and won the battle of Smolensk against chieftain Svatoslav of Smolensk. Journey back home was not easy, but High Chiefess Regenhilda entered the city among triumphant. And now let us rejoice and feast for her legend is to be celebrated. Because that is the first one that we have complete in the world. And obviously, I'm presuming that we're going to know of these legends regardless of the distance between their realm and our realm, because it's a legend. It's going to be something that carries across the sea, over the mountains. On the tongues of bards. Yes, we uh, have a truth with you. 
few years. So military strength is still superior to art. You've got about the same amount of money, but you are in a war. Because you're wanting a little bit of land there. So that could hopefully work in our favour for now. Because hopefully you're going to start gobbling up that land and we can uh, hunker down here for a little bit. Then do what we do. One of our kids died of old age. Uh, okay. Still have a truce. How long? 15 months. With a steward, we don't really have anyone who's any good. Powerful vassal, apparently. With a hundred gold, a uh, hundred troops. Yes, I believe you. Yes, you're very, very powerful with a hundred troops. Done. Okay, peasant rabble, that's fine. They won't be uh, too much trouble. I hope at least. <laughs> they shouldn't be too much trouble. Uh -oh, it might actually be worth increasing the size of these. It's 76 gold each. But they are pretty good. They're going to be good. This is our six God son one level one diplomacy education is great a train team definitely interesting would it be to 165 gold so basically all the gold I just spent on uh, getting my camel men at arms thing up How far are we on that? 21 years. 30 years. If I clicked on that one, that would be 13. The daughter-in-law has given birth to a son who is... Yeah, that is our heir's heir. Robust is not bad. Robust is But So we've got someone who we could reinforce that trait with. Or we've got someone that we can actually get um, the intelligent trait with. Hello, I am not a bot. Life's hard. Sorry, I'll be here often now. Please do not apologise for not being able to make it to streams. I understand everyone has their own life. Everyone has their own situations. Good, bad, neutral to deal with. So if you can't make a stream, if you can't make loads of streams, do not apologise because I do. I understand it's not your fault and I won't be annoyed or disappointed or anything like that okay but I think I'm gonna try and get the um, intelligent trait in the dynasty try to right game game I know I really only have I think two vassals Oh no, I've got seven vassals. Okay, I've got seven vassals. And you choose the one that's in prison to tell me about um, all of these stones. Okay, erected by a lost expedition of the savage Russia. Local forest dwellers have taken a li liking to these stones. So, forgotten stones loses that popular opinion plus 10. Um... He gains minus 20 opinion of us. He absolutely hates us anyway. Um, no, I think we shall listen to the forest dwellers. They are for sure pagan idols and must be smashed to pieces. Um, sorry about that. Claimant to the Ottoman Duchy. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Unfortunately... He's got a claim on a duchy, would you? The only thing that us doing this would do is changing the rulership. He joins your court. Yes. You'll join our court for now. You'll be pretty good. Marshal and the chip. 
Uh, you're considered a powerful vessel. Our sun elf. Um, what was speed? I don't know. But yeah, please do not worry if you can't make a stream for whatever reason. I understand you all have lives and <laughs> various situations going on. I mean, I've been absent. I'm streaming for a while anyway. Okay, so increase diplomacy by one, thirty percent chance of being fifty. I shall collect tax favorably. I will say attend to the needs of the people because getting your diplomacy up one is gonna be a nice little boost. How's it been going? Uh hit and miss on occasion, being honest. Is that I'm trying to track down why I might be feeling so exhausted all the time. And so far things have been inconclusive, to say the least. Still have, yes, three months. Three months before I can start to revoke titles. Go with the Peasant Revolt. I really don't need all of these troops here, but we are going to send them in. They're gonna absolutely destroy. Percent. Gonna go to the prison. We're gonna check the right person. We are going to check if you have any money. Of course, we don't. I'm now going to execute because I do not tolerate upstart peasants in this realm. I do not tolerate upstart peasants in this realm. And yeah, we probably disband all of our troops. Uh, training in warfare. I mean, oh my goodness. Okay. Wow, she is doing horrifically in intrigue. Unfortunately, she is horrifically intrigue. Um, we've guardian. Yes, see. So yeah, chronic exhaustion, um, I'm pretty sure people, if I say chronic fatigue syndrome, you know what I'm talking about, but it's not that, because I don't have, like, the actual full bone-deep exhaustion, I'm just continually tired, I'm just continually tired, hence why I call it chronic exhaustion rather than chronic fatigue. Because exhaustion is like a level below fatigue. So it's just a situation where I'm tired a lot. I'm tired a lot of the time. I'm tracking my sleep, tracking my stress, trying to see if there's anything there. But all I'm getting is that I'm always stressed. I never get restful sleep. So I don't know what's going on. So I don't know what's going on there. Okay, neither of those are... Oh, possible outcomes, 100%. Gain 150. Gain's opinion. And piety. Yeah, I'll be fine. Go out to the pub drinking together is always a good way to make a new friend. Hope you'll be better eventually. Depends who I can talk to and depends what I might be able to get help with. But, oh, but uh, thank you for the um, kind thoughts. Anyway. Oh, yes. You will make an excellent night. Uh, speaking of that, actually, yes. No, there's still no way for me to um, get those uh, night orders up. Maybe it's just because I'm not in the right region for it. I honestly cannot remember why. I honestly cannot remember why it was like that. So four years, yes, we'll book all up. 
Start development eight. Getting good on. Two thousand four hundred and nineteen. Yeah, eventually, so it might not be soon. Well, look at it this way. I've been living with it like this for long for a long time. It's just annoying when I want to try and be more productive than I'm able to be. Yes, hope I start to feel better sometime. So do I. It'd be nice to be able to not need as much sleep and be able to get a few things done each week. Okay, so this is uh, level three education, not bad. Okay, so that puts you at 11. Fortunately, you got the collusive stress. Millennial, yep, send proposal. So I got a notification of one child. Okay, you are. So you're all married, so you should start having children. I suppose, seeing as for now, we do have a grandson that has robust. We might as well stick with our eldest as the heir for now, especially as I do know that he um, practices our religion in secret. Yes, we've got that for our son and heir there, and then also our second eldest. Unfortunately, weren't able to do it for any of the others. It might be an idea for us to actually educate our grandson as well. Infectious, pernicious, vicious, delicious, suspicious, malicious. I'm pretty sure I mispronounced at least one of those. I'm pretty sure I mispronounced at least one of those. You're not going to get me with a tongue twister quite that easily. That's opinion plus 50 it is probably not really necessarily what we need. Okay, Dynasty Legacy. Now this is the interesting one. Because we've got Heroic Bloodline and Legitimacy for this. Which are our two new... Oh, and Brilliance as well. Our house shall be resplendent with glory from the things of old. Ah, uh, no. Sorry. Brilliance looks like from the um, Legacy of Persia DLC. Sorry, because this is Persian. Like, tax jurisdictions, Master Assassin, Court Scholar, Chief Caddy, Lady in Waiting, and Royal Architect. Oh, we're not paused. Lofty Ambitions. Light of Glory, Ancient Force, Splendor Born. Uh, so, how am I feeling besides Tired? Glad to be back streaming and glad to be here with Crusader Kings 3 and a bit of uh, new content. So I have put in the schedule that this is going to be Tuesdays and Thursdays at 6pm local UK time. So fingers crossed I'm going to be able to keep that up and we'll just have to see how it goes. But I am excited because Reaper's Due for Crusader Kings 2 was one of my favourite DLCs for Crusader Kings 2 and I am so glad we've got all the disease mechanics back for Crusader Kings 3 now this has been the one I have been waiting for and also the fact that we are potentially going to get landless rulers later on in the year is also going to open up our wide range of possibilities for so anyway legitimacy the right to rule the power to do so so rightful rulers, control growth up and popular opinion. Each heir starts with the lasting line modifier, boosting their legitimacy for 10% for the first 10 years. Dynasty opinion plus 5 unlocks access to the espoused legitimacy intent, allowing you to build legitimacy during some activities, such as a funeral, feast and grand divine mandate. Vassals are less likely to join discipline actions and payment factors. You et mon droit. Select a fifth level education trait to make more common within your dynasty. So, I'm not sure what DLC is it. I think it may have been tours and tournaments, but 
you can send your child to university, potentially go to university yourself, and have your education level increased. If you have a level 4 education trait, you can get that increased to level 5. And then this is saying that you can select one fifth level education trait to make more common within your dynasty. Let me just take a drink for a second. Sorry, dry throat there. <clears throat> so if I wanted to have, say, a dynasty that was focused on martial education, I could select this and say I want the level 5 martial education to be more common. Which, if I understand it correctly, means that if a child is obviously educated in martial and they have the potential to get the level 4 education trait, this makes it so it adds an additional role to check to see if they can get the level 5 education trait, which could be game changing. And then the other one, Heroic Bloodline, is obviously all about the bloodlines of the DLC. Aha! There you are. It was you, Prez, wasn't it? It was you who said about the, um, uh, da 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 da, uh, assassin ancestry legend. There you go. There it is. There it is. You can't see it, but I'm pointing at the screen at the chat. <laughs> you can't see it, but I'm pointing to the screen at chat at you. There you are. Gains a great deed for Sassanid Legend Seed. Oh, usable only once per dynasty, but can be used by any member. Mythical Ancestors grants access to the Ancestral Claim as a spell eye on any claims gained through a legitimizing legend. Golden Legend gains the venerated Ancestor trait upon completion of a Mythical Holy Legend and Legend Creation Discount event. Whilst the Living Legend trait upon completion of a mythical hero heroic legend is creation discount 25%, you are going to get the Venerated Ancestor Piety and Legitimacy gain. This one, Prestige Legitimacy gain, so 2 and 2. And that one's Prestige, okay, got that one. And then down in history, Domain Taxes and Clergy Opinion unlocks access to the legendary Watch Tower. Um, you think that one's a generic thing where it gives you for your dynasty, it's not spe specific to the Sassanids. Yes, but it's still there, you can unlock it. There we go, so we've now got that dynasty seed. Which is, I think, honestly, a good compromise because I didn't realise that that was there. So we'd actually have this. Obviously it's a um, night between the historical and then being able to kind of not create one out of thin air but kind of have a look around at like your local legend and culture and such. Lose the glasses. Really? Really? <laughs> really? Aye. Okay, 10 minute timer coming up. There we go, okay. We all glasses are coming off. My eyesight has seriously gotten worse since I did this. <laughs> My eyesight has seriously gotten worse since I left. So uh yeah, you're gonna see me struggle to try and read all of this. Thank you very much. I am not a bot. Um owner modifiers renown plus point one a month to point five. Monthly renown plus five percent to plus twenty percent. Uh, stewardship plus one to plus four renown. Okay, yeah, that is renown 0 0.01 to 0 0.1 a month. And development growth plus one percent to plus six percent. Popular opinion plus five to plus twenty. Unfortunately, we can't create it just yet because we don't have two hundred gold. So we're going to have to wait on. That. But the fact that we can actually come here. Go to the um, dynasty renown thing and actually kind of unearth a local legend seed for your region and culture. That is 
I think, a good middle ground between the options of having only legendary ones and not having any at all. Okay, demonstration of leadership. So do we go and discuss methods of communication? Expected figurehead, levy recruitment. Ten years. No, I think I'll go with the top one, actually. Uh, need to head out now? Yep, no problem, Prez. I'm probably going to be wrapping up at, in the next half an hour uh, anyway, because I'm going to need to get to bed. Um, hope you have a good rest of your day, and I will try and have a rest of the stream. Thank you. Thank you for popping by. Okay, so we are actually gaining two gold. It's going to be beneficial. Us and we're collecting, we're just increasing development. Have a look. Wrong thing here. This isn't me because I don't have my glasses. This is just me trying to get used to the new UI. Um, so, this, I can. In mustering grounds, yes. There we go. Public works. Counties now reach the maximum existing development penalty at 20. So, okay, we don't need to click off that when we get to 10. We leave it. So, this is our second son, I think. You have a son who has nothing. Oh, come on. Seriously, what do you want now? I didn't mean to click on that one. You're seriously just going to keep on coming in here, chipping away at all my territories. You're seriously going to keep coming in here and chipping away at all my territories. Annoying. I'll just leave it there that. You annoying. You major annoying. Okay, we'll check. Merge arms. Do we have... No, we do not have any allies we can call in. Hopefully we do have uh, some money, so it's not going to happen anytime soon. Um... Do I still need to keep on swaying you? Probably not. Especially seeing as I think you were my old spy master and we've now changed. Oh no, no. You are still the same spy master, but we do now have you at 100 opinion. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna change to self. Oh yeah, yeah, that was enough for them to reconsider. That was enough for you to reconsider. Okay, so that is... Oh, come on! What do you want? Okay, that's the existing one. That is that one. Okay, you yourself. Similar amount of groups. Uh... Yeah, okay, so yours is just genuinely all your own troops. I really despise it when the AI does this. Yeah, so you've brought in a thousand troops there. Hopefully that's the only one that will happen. Uh, White Peace will not accept. You can't hear it, but I'm muttering swears under my breath. Honestly, probably what I'm just going to do here is see if I can siege down your territory enough okay where's our military thing we are so close peacemaker so if we can manage to stay ahead um that's going to be 14 months that's three months okay your places are not well defended at all your places are seriously not well defended at I honestly have no idea how I'm going to manage getting the other people, though. 
Okay, that's that. Uh, white piece, yes. Sod off. Sod off. Okay, that's one more dealt with. Any other question? If I try and run in, so we will probably lose. Prisoner has escaped. Right. We are going to have to wait to take that land back then. Okay, there it is. There's Peacemaker. Okay, so you're heading probably... Yeah, so if we come down here, is that... I am jokingly going to say only notify me if they have a level 3 genetic trait. I'm not serious in that, it's just I have other things to really concentrate on for the moment. I'm also getting hiccups. Good. Um... I go here. Each down. Yes. Have any money? I. Do we have any prisoner? Do. No. Don't have any of them that are useful. Or score. Um. Okay. You're not worth anything. In gold. Okay. Only the two kids. Just the two kids that are worth anything. Um, okay, your trait is. Oh, I have one minute and 40 seconds, okay. Uh, anyway, organizer, movement, speed, retreat, not it. You can just go. You can just go. Your prowess is two. You know what? Just, yeah, just leave. Just leave, all of you, just leave. They lawfully imprison my vassal, off what cost it. Their war, powerful vassal wants the council position, the county control. Yes, I know all of these things are. Um, is that the good grandson or the not so good grandson? That's the not so good grandson, that's fine. Okay, apparently it's not um, the high level person or against it's just a person who wants a random county uh, so that is seven months that's five months okay so we might be able to pull ahead again and there's a playground oh oh we've got the dancing plague people we have the dancing Lake. Shaitan's fire. Character suffers from painful sickness, headaches, nausea, and diarrhea. Their involuntary spasms make it look as if they were dancing. That's nearby, so that's right there. Is that the only one? Oh. Yeah, thank you. Okay, I can put my glasses. Thank goodness, I can put my glasses back on. And I can actually see now. Okay, right, let's see how we're doing on this one. Daughter, daughter only a level one great. Okay, you look like you've actually just broken through that. Five months, 50 days. Okay, so we might be able to go for this and do a white piece, please. Twenty-three percent. Okay. White piece. Yes. Thank you. Ooh, there we go. And I'm not a bot. Lurking. No problem. Thank you. Look. So isolate capital. Enter. 
because we are big. So hopefully we should now have enough. Oh, uh, architect, yes, because I've seen that one go as well. So yes, we have a plague that is in com. It is a uh, pretty so and let me just have a look. Will not succeed. Delta of prison hit rise up in rebellion with thirty build up vessel. Be minus a hundred percent. Let me just see if there are any other disgruntled vessels or I mean, yes, but do with you. Oh, I can revoke your titles anyway. Okay, fifteen percent, maybe not. <laughs> what would I want to have? Yeah, I thought as much. This time, however, this time, however, we are not going to let you linger in the dungeons long enough for you to escape. We are going, oh no, no, oh no, we have got the Dancing Plague in our... This is our player Aaron's son, yep, Dancing Plague. Might survive should luck be on his. The choice is up to him. Gain the trait Holy Fire. And okay, one of our other sons died. Uh, gain 38 stress, become a rival. No, I don't want to bother with um, the regular. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> Apparently he was uh, leading that army. They disbanded all. Uh, yeah, legitimacy gained 50. Okay, now, now we are going to revoke all of your title. In criminal, yeah, break title. Uh, act of tyranny, so we can't do that. However, what we can do, um, where is it? Oh, yeah, so if we ransom him, we tell him to renounce his claim. So he only keeps one thing. Uh, how much would you ransom out 50 gold? No, renounce your claims, and you can go free. You will have your one territory. And that would be it. Yes, unfortunately, we do have a plague. So that is plague resistance plus 50. Yes. Definite. And I never did build that. Um, <laughs> I never did build that hospice I said I was going to. Oops. Okay, we are missing a steward. Our top one is 13. Honestly, I'm not going to bother giving it to you. 17, actually. Especially seeing as, um... Ah, no, you don't. Unfortunately, you don't, um... Have a low enough skill to uh, get injured with that one. Oh, well, you can go and... Spread convert... Um, spread control. Better control. A 13... It'll be fine. No, apparently you've also got Holy Fire. This is not going to look good, is it? Obviously over our domain. So, if we got rid of this one. Uh, um, let me see. So we want R and we want Tent, if at all possible, and a high stewardship. Wait. 
Honestly, you'll do. You'll do. That will get us to our 5 out of 5 domain. We are. So do we want to isolate our capital? Do we want to end seclusion? Must retreat to the outskirts of the capital in seclusion, safe from the miasma of plague and disease. Or do we reinforce the walls, close the gate and throw the keys? That is a decision that I think will actually go for our next stream. So we have a plague in our lands. We've just defeated a bunch of people who want to try and take over land. We've managed to fight them off successfully. But we do have a vassal who is not too uh, friendly towards us. So that is going to potentially cause us some issue. So let me just go and... Oh my goodness, there is a load of people online today. <laughs> wow. Okay, let me have a look. Who have we got? Um, got someone playing Civ 6. That could be a nice one to go on from here. We've got someone playing Pacific Drive, which I've not seen myself, but apparently quite a good one. Uh, hey, hey, Lean is playing Tunic. I don't want to go and raid them because I want to play that game myself. I think it's on Game Pass now. So I don't want to play that because I don't want to get spoiled. I don't want to go to Alness for Pony Island because same thing. Um, Quilts and Cats of Calico. What on earth is that? Oh my goodness. Okay. Yes. Yes. We are raiding Urban Bohemia because, oh my goodness, cats. If you're missing the cats in Crusader Kings 3, this is probably a brilliant game. So, raid message. Let's get that up. And then, raid Urban Bohemia. Okay. So I will say thank you very much everyone for by hanging out chatting it is very very appreciated so we are going to raid urban bohemian playing a game called quilts and cats of calico which appropriate enough when I loaded in has cats <laughs> has quilts so we're going to go and say hello and uh say hello so let's go pop in say hello and i see you all here. thank you very much for now thank you very much and bye bye for now